So I'm here with Sam, um, Sam from Turnup. Uh, we're here in Bangalore, and you and your team have just been taking me to Caddisfly. So tell me, well, tell me about a bit about what you're doing. All right. So we're trying to develop this low-cost water quality test kit, and we have a we think we have a decent product in in the fluoride test, and we're also trying to develop a coliforms test around this. So it, it, this this program. Well, I mean, the product really has been almost sort of incubated out of Argium here in Bangalore, but really driven by an um, by by the water hackathon. That I wouldn't say incubated. Uh, the idea started from here, certainly. Yeah, because um, you were involved with the India Water Portal yes, for a long time. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. Let's keep going. Yeah. <laughs> so, so, so the India Water Portal. So, the, the, you you were well aware of the issues that you were trying to address. Yes, thanks yeah. to my involvement in the India Water Portal and thanks to my networking with the guys at Argyan, I, I did know that fluoride was a big problem and that measuring fluoride on the field was a huge, huge challenge. Which is why we took that up at the Water Hackathon. Yeah. So the, there are some tests that are already well established and well proven to test for f- fluoride and some other contaminants, yeah? Yes, uh, what we've basically done is taken a very well-established field test and automated it on the phone. That's what we've done. Yeah. So it's based on color? It's based on a color change and the mobile camera tests the, the color change and calibrates it and compares it with the calibrated value that we have in its memory. And that gives a fairly decent, fairly accurate reading. Okay. So, um, you 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 started doing this. Uh, it, I mean, the idea came together at a at a hackathon. Yes. And you brought a team together. Yes. Um, but what's been the experience of trying to take take this technology to, to get it to get it through its testing phases and get it to scale? Massively difficult because I'm a because we are first time entrepreneurs. We put it that way. Um, uh, we got a bit of a grant from the Water and Sanitation Program, which helped us hugely. That's a World Bank. That's a yeah. World Bank subsidiary. Uh, but we couldn't raise subsequent grants or we couldn't raise subsequent in- investment after that. And we tried to raise some money from consulting, which was very stressful and payments were not very regular. So that, so, we, so it was hard work, but generally not very... Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so ACVO's now involved with this. Yes, I can. And we're helping you identify new funding sources. Yes. Um, so what's the? I, I'm going to talk to some of the rest of the team in a minute. So uh, what's what's the next stage of uh, work for you? We need to finish off with these products, make them make at least a fluoride test available to customers. We need to get the coliforms okay. test. We think that's a huge winner. We need to get that out in the field as soon as we can. These two things are like big things. And later on, we need to diversify, make more products, more more tests. Um, that's what I Okay, great. Well, it's really nice to meet you. Thanks. Thanks.